Before we get into the video, I want to give a huge thank you to Anon for supporting us over on Patreon. If you want to support us yourself and gain some additional perks, you can find a link to the Patreon down in the description. Welcome custom car fans! This is Aurora representing the EXU staff team and today we'll be covering the newest ban list to go into effect on EXU following the introduction of a new TCG set in Photon Hypernova. Without a new ban list in the TCG to accompany this change in EXU, I am luckily left with a much reduced workload. However, there are still a number of cards from the old format that also need addressing as well as cards just coming in from the new set. So without further ado, let's get into the list. Firstly, let's take a look at the elephant in the room, Kash Tera. This new TCG meta threat managed to push back against the Ishizu Tillamont's OCG Tier 0 format, and if left untouched, would surely do the same thing here. With our resident orc to make sure that every broken deck we underestimate is sufficiently represented, Sprite and Ishizu Tillamont still ringing in our ears, we didn't want to leave Kash Tera under hit this time around. The deck has a number of exceptionally degenerate plays available to it, and it is undoubtedly the strongest rank 7 strategy that has ever existed in the game so far. Unnecessary Dragon Ruler Shade. As a result, we've decided to ban Kashtira Arise Heart, the second Xyz released for this archetype due to its ease of access combined with its frightening power in being both a floodgate and a removal piece. In addition, Kashtira Theosis, formerly Kashtira Papias, is also banned, as it was still enabled to generate zone lock strategies formed through Shangri Era and Diablosis the Mind Hacker. The final hit for this deck is Kashtira Unicorn, which is being limited alongside Kashtira Fenrir. While this is certainly a large consistency hit for the deck, it should be able to function in a significantly weakened state by using the also newly released and untouched Kashtira Rise Heart. As Unicorn is our only limit this time around, it makes sense to now discuss the rest of the bands. Gigantic Champion Sargus has been banned for its excessive power in Springen's decks, as well as granting generic easy access for machine decks to Therion's King Regulus, a card we have limited for its excellent power. Guard Dog is a card we're preemptively banning before someone boring like myself decides to pick up Prediction Princess, and for its interactions with a couple of specific custom decks. Silver, Warlord of Darkworld, is also being banned even in the absence of Darkworld tops, as staff has come to a new consensus that the hand rip is too powerful and exceptionally easy to enable. In addition, Darkworld loses very little by Silver's ban, as alternative options in Lucent and Gold make the deck far more interesting. The Bestial Lubellion is a card that has had significant outcry for its ban for a considerable period of time, for quite evident reasons. The ability to search the limited Bestial Magnemut was a significant perk, and being able to summon it from the graveyard afterwards as an extender in Chaos and Dragon Link decks was just too much. Finally, as tradition dictates, White Dragon Wyver Burster has been forbidden from competitive play. Why? Because we can, and we enjoy flexing our power. Finally, there are a couple of unhits that shouldn't need too much discussion. Obviously, the previously mentioned Black Dragon Collop Serpent has been released as per usual, and the other cards moved to three are Eldritch the Golden Lord and Sword Soul Strategist Long Yuan. These strategies have been quite stagnant, and we want to inject some life into them since moving them from one to two didn't do too much to further their viability. And no, we're not unbanning Moye. Over my dead body. So, what are the strongest decks in the new format? Hopefully, Kashtira doesn't rear its ugly head too much but with some of the recent support from Photon Hypernova, it's possible that a different deck manages to take the reins. Could it be Springens? Gishki? You can find out yourself by clicking the link in the description of this video to join our Discord server, where you can play competitively and casually and talk with hundreds of custom card creators around the world. Make sure to like the video if you enjoyed, subscribe and click the notification bell if you want to be updated every time we upload. That'll be all from me, and we'll see you next time.